Welcome, welcome, welcome to game two of night three of Halloween 5. One day I will find a way to better pack all these numbers together. Night three, game two, Halloween 5, Layers of Fear 2. I rather enjoyed Layers of Fear. Uh, it had some problems, but that's what sequels are for, in my view. Nope, we've been fooled by this shit before. <laughs> Always go a little bit higher than the recommended. Oh, they have a full-scale slider for the subtitles. That's nice. I actually don't want to deal with the head bob tonight. Not gonna lie. Everything else looks good. Normal mode, safe mode. I don't remember there being that many monsters in the first game. It was a lot of jump scares and just impossible space, which was pretty cool. Take a shot every time Dave says a number. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20... I'm sorry. This is incredibly pretty right away. We need some kind of ship? Looks more like a hotel. But it's swaying and rocking. We have a run right off the bat. Ah. Oh, yeah, it's one of these. Being pulled in. Whoa! <laughs> the unmooring. Yeah, it does seem to be a ship, huh? Let's go. How does this relate to the first game? So the first game was about a painter. This game is about an actor? Connect the memories, dreams, and fears. Prepare for the big roll. Okay. Can climb that first. Hmm. I mean, come to think of it, Layers of Fear itself was a pretty gorgeous game in its own right. So I shouldn't be surprised that this one is also really pretty. Also had a ton of small little cubby holes and whatnot where you could miss keys. <laughs> uh, so long. I have struggled to finish what was started. I had nearly lost hope, and yet here we are. Ah.
Oops. Hope you settle in all right. Remember what we talked about. Focus on what you do best. Go to this special that special place of yours. Find your motivation. Build the character. Trust me, it'll be worth it. We'll try to keep you uh, try to keep in touch. Travel safe, your friend and agent. Arth says, honestly, ships are just kind of naturally scary settings. Maybe it's because I grew up in a seaside town, but there are so many stories of terrible mishaps and nasty things. It's also, I think what makes a ship at sea a perfect horror setting is the isolation. Oh. Oh, that's just that door. Mm, okay. We've kind of double-checked things here. Same reason space and spaceships work so well for horror. Oh, that's pretty. It's like the clouds are on fire. Look at this bullshit! Hmm. So there's that. There's probably nothing down here, but... Worth checking all the same. Holy shit. I'm noticing there are way less interactable objects of no consequence in this one compared to Layers of Fear where it was you could just touch everything and it was kind of annoying. Uh, build a character. Preparation. Explore. Who am I? Where am I? Where's your motivation? Hmm. I just take a little reel of film? Or a roll? observes the others, while the others watch him. He's expected to behave properly, wandering through worlds that aren't really there. He puts on masks and adjusts accordingly. Each mask is a character, each character a layer. A layer of fear? build the character he was meant to portray or lose himself completely submerged tightly surrounded by lives he's never lived and yet he stands on a stage where every man must play a part and his is a sad one now I'm motivated I'm gonna turn the game up Nice and loud. Loud. So what has this changed about the rest of the boat now? Because that was a big gimmick of Layers of Fear. Esteemed Traveler, as per the director's request, the section of the ship has been closed off to all passengers and crew. We wish you a pleasant and fulfilling day. Icarus Transatlantic. Don't ever name your travel anything Icarus don't name anything you do Icarus it's it's such a self-sabotaging name you're setting yourself up to fail Interesting. 
Oh, shit. Holy shit, that was a cool scare. Oh my god, that was really cool! It's like naming something Pandora. Yeah, or Titanic. Hmm. Maybe later. Oh no, wait, maybe right now. I thought there was more to this room. Nice. I like the noise. Listen. Oh no. Once you get there, just do what you have to do. Get to the set and build this character for him. That's all that matters. We have two doors. Oh, yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah! I just want to see a hint of some bullshit under there. Damn! I thought that was a human-shaped silhouette. You hear some whispers. Yeah, yeah, I know you've told me a million times how much you hate the seat. And I'm telling you, this gig is just too good to pass up. Ah, yes, back in the good old days where you would have a dedicated person whose job it was to operate the elevator. We're a true... We are a true man of, of class and capability operating the elevator on our own. Way more whispers. Can you all hear those? Hey, Arth, not next year because next year is going to be Eurovision time. Uh, but maybe the year after that. Can I come over on Halloween and we can go trick or treating? Would that not be the best time? Boot. Hey, y'all. Das boot. Uh, unprecedented move. Director decided to shoot his next motion picture aboard an ocean liner traveling across the... Oh, okay. Plot details are kept under wraps, but trusted sources claim that the project is found its star in... An obvious choice, perhaps, given the star's fabled career and numerous critically acclaimed roles. It seems that the recent worrying rumors as to the artist's personal life have not dissuaded the director. Did Dave do Visage last year? I believe I did, and I didn't like it. Like 
trick-or-treating is for kids, and if we try to step on that, we will be the most selfish people. And I have to live here, you feel? No, that sucks. Adults should be able to trick-or-treat, Arthur. Arth, please. Trick-or-treating is for all. Keys. I actually have no idea what those keys are for. Because there have been a lot of locks. Uh, am I stuck on the cabinet? security officer. The new procedures come into force as of next week. The company holds you personally responsible for enforcing them. Prepare all the guards for detailed briefings. As you're well aware, there have been prior incidents. Oh no. Unwanted individuals stowing away. Stowaways will not be tolerated. Every motherfucker must pay. I wonder if the key was specifically for that, because it looked like it had been consumed. Halloween is my favorite holiday. Only reason I like it now is because of Halloween. Oh, it's always been my favorite holiday. It's my favorite month, my favorite holiday, my favorite time of year. I love October. Try sprinting. Uh, I already have run around. But I don't want to just sprint all over the place. Because I might miss shit. like, well-camouflaged flashlights. <laughs> oh man, that damn electrical buzz. Your vision's a pretty good holiday. It's a pretty good one. Oh. Okay. Oh. Now that we have that message out in the world for everybody to decode, we can we can leave. See if you can figure out what that message said. I'm sure Rye will get right on decoding that. <laughs> okay, there's quite a bit going on there. Uh, I guess we will take this room right now. Uh, scary business. Immense courage. Lose consciousness of your own self and not just reenact, but become the character. Huh, okay. Oh yeah, the acting by... <laughs> was nothing short of transcendent. Good night, Barla. Seemed like it was just the newspaper. 
Unless I am mistaken. Okay, good. Hey, 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 hey. Rude. This rude man slamming doors on me. Is that this door I heard? Maybe. Okay. Guy's got a reputation. Makes his actors jump through hoops before he even lets them on the set. Supposed to be some new method of building the character. Bunch of artsy fartsy bullshit, if you ask me. Just go with it. Guy doesn't take no for an answer. That's true. I did say that you're a very good boy, Rai. I also said that I wonder who will take the time to decode my Morse code message, and I said that would probably be you. I know how much you like just uh, decoding Morse code. Jeepers, creepers. Am I looping? Oh, I've started this looping shit. I think it's all an act. Layers of Fear was big on the looping. To all officers, most of you are already aware of the Hollywood motion picture of me and shot. We're sending you detailed guidelines, which decks are, uh, are to be restricted for regular passengers. Film crew and cast are not to be disturbed. Mm. Oh, that's just the prompt for the drawer again. Hmm. Cool. Literally all the worlds a stage. The world's a stage with a play oh my god. Cast. Did I call that line or what? Loops. Did somebody say loops. No. Before the world told you who you should be. Oh. Do you remember who you were? Oh. Come. I will make you remember. Okay, Satan. What the fuck? I believe in you. Wake up, Mr. Hardy. We've got to get out of this godforsaken prison before we rot. You can pretend I didn't see the birdcage fly off. Okay. Pie 
pirates? Oops. How do we use you? I can't rotate this at all, right? No, not really. Hmm. So the answer has to be in the room. Three digits and it's just numeric? Okay. We can figure that out, no problem. Wait, can I look at the thing below the... Hmm. Is there something etched in the leather? Uh, I can't really tell. Before we get to the next game, I'm taking bets on Dave not picking up the flashlight yet. Okay. <sighs> You're assuming there is a flashlight. Let's see. Still not entirely sure what to make of this. Something on the other side I can see. Ah, 165. I was hoping that would be like an actual puzzle and not just a look in the right spot. That was a little unfulfilling. Are we, are we really going? Lily, I, I'm... That's Captain Baines to you, Mr. Hardy. Remember the name, Quartermaster, or I'll have you walk the plank. Dave, the entire chat was yelling for like five minutes. Yep, I was playing the game. Ah, shut up about it. Come on. Oh, this is neat. No, really, please do. Oh boy, I don't need these fun little dopey streams to turn into sources of performance anxiety. Thank you. Was the button do? Oh, I get. It. Damn it, every time I go to grab it, I like miss the first click. Quite. Oh, you can put it in slow motion and just adjust it slowly. It's not quite it. Nope. This is such an awkward spot to work in. Ah, damn it. Come on. That's got to be close enough. Just give it, give it, give it, give it. Is 
Is that not it? Or does it still need to just be a little more? How precise do you have to be? Thank you. Okay. Little freaky. Uh, no, but for real, and this is going for like every stream I've ever done or every video I've ever done. But if uh, chat is just full of like memeing about shit that I miss or things that I don't do well, uh, I will not have a good time and I will not want to do it anymore. These images, memories of you, they've been haunted. Because I will get super anxious constantly that I'm about to miss something or that I have missed something. Uh, and it will cease being fun. Oh no, you're you're a good ra uh, bad wrong fun. I'm just throwing that out there for everyone that I don't enjoy that at all. Luckily, it doesn't happen that often, but still. Jesus Christ, I hate the looks of that. So it's leading us here? And then out to here. And then splitting the path. That's not for right now. Oh God! What was that? Oh shit! Oh my god. It was only around long enough to get a glimpse, but that seemed huge. And it... It was in my periphery for such a short amount of time that I did not even get like a good concept of what it looked like just big i'm back mahardy scouted out the whole area looks like there's a trail we can follow a trail i left by fellow pirates no doubt to lead us to a safe harbor oh yeah um dead end road is the name of that game with wolk and the potato sacrificed to satan that was a really good one. I still want to go back to that and beat it. This is way better about making objects and interactables that matter stand out uh, compared to the first game. Break over. Last repair technician leaves the ship through the gangway on E-deck. Aft. Patrolling the waterfront along the ship. On patrol near the cargo area. Saw a shadow move. Small, most likely a child. Gave chase. Could not find anyone. Line circled in red. Um, watch over. Okay. It was very easy to miss stuff in the first layers of fear because there were a million drawers and a million things you can interact with that didn't actually do anything. And nothing really stood out very well. There she is, Mr. Hardy. The fastest vessel ever built. Ready to set sail for the land of the flame. I don't see any sails. Shh. We must make our way aboard. Quietly. Oh, what was the... Arth, I don't remember which game you're talking about with the kid shoving the entire dead crow in his pocket. 
Oh, what was that? I fucking hate this so much. Like you wouldn't believe. Does this matter at all? Was it powerfully Slavic child where he uh where he shoved a crow in his pocket? A vast Mr. Hardy. Too many of them scurvy dogs to take head on. Lily, I want to go home. Quartermaster, steal yourself. Be your heart soaked in doubt, or be there a fire burning within. I can't wait to finish that with you, Arth. I've been holding off on beating that and uninstalling it for a year. Oh, nice. Hole. Oh. Also, Layers of Fear 1 was all about the impossible space, so I welcome this. It was the best part. Oh my god, that looks so cool! <gasps> oh my god, hell yes! And there's more to this, right? It would be kind of cool if this, if we were turning the ship, or if we were supposed to be turning it like a, uh, like a combination lock. Clip real quick while you still can. Sorry, what? Oh, just grab it off the VOD if you uh, if you want a screen cap of it. I see we're back in 1918, before the invention of color. Oh, it's this room. So, how much of that was filled in before? Because we were supposed to be filling in character. I think we've gotten an H so far. Be ready to go back. Okay. I'm guessing this is going to change when I walk through that door this time. Just going to double check around. Doesn't seem like there's anything. Although, being black and white, I think it would be easy to miss a prompt. Yeah, it was just act before, so we got an H.
but is it locked? Yes. Oh, that sound cuts right through you. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, I hate it. Um, where are the shh? It's locked. I could still open it. Hit the locked icon. This is not good. What if I hit this again? Oh, I'm supposed to be avoiding the spotlights, I think? Oh my god, I think I may have actually been right about the wheel for the ship. Uh, hmm. 10 to the right, 80 left, 40 right. I'm not going to remember that. RLR, 10, 184. RLR, 184. Let's try that. One eight four. Oh, fuck. Let me just make sure the safe is not in this room. One eight four RLR. Okay. One eight four RLR. One eight four RLR. Ten eighty forty right left right. I don't know if I just crawled in a circle. I think I did. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be a nightmare. So try to avoid the left here. So is it this? Okay, there's a bit of a problem. Unless this is... No, this can't be the combination lock. I just have to keep turning this. Here we go. Oh, it's right on the safe. That sucks. I feel cheated almost. So 10 to the right. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, it's the opposite. I always do this with lockers or with locker combinations. seen behind shut eyes the one of bright shores caressed by tide where there's no pain no fear no fury no lies 
There we shall stand tall, our hearts full of pride. If your dreams are bold, and by no man bound, if your soul is strong, unlike any other, able Yeah, right, it's weird. I always hated those those types of combination locks. Then yours is this world, my little brother. Especially the ones where you would have to do a full revelation, or revolu- sorry, revolution past some of the numbers those always sucked where it was like 10 to the right and then 20 to the left going past 10 like a full circle around and then 87 right I hate those so much Rather just have like a four digit padlock with each uh each set of tumblers tied to like one column of numbers. Those are the best locks. Mr. Hardy is a quartermaster, and that's a very important thing to be because a quartermaster takes care of getting the crew where it needs to be and also makes sure there's plenty of food and rum for everyone. Mr. Hardy is very loyal to the captain and always follows orders because he knows that he, the captain, not Mr. Hardy, is a fearless leader. The captain sometimes gets crossed with Mr. Hardy, but that's only because he cares greatly about the whole crew. The truth is, bottom of the page torn off. Rum. Oh, I never used uh, the lockers that we were assigned in, in, like, middle school and high school. They just never bothered. I think throughout the entirety of high school, I didn't even know which locker mine was supposed to be. Yum, 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 yum. I ate the deer. This is really cool. Okie dokie. I'm going to say, can I go through that? Is there a tunnel or something? That would be kind of nifty. Oh, there's a door. Oh, cool. Yeah. What in the hell? Hmm. This is just a very nifty game that I'm digging. Okie dokie. This fellow is wise enough to play the fool. We always come with a burden. All right, Satan. Many shoes. Oh, that creates a An unpleasant sight. Figures, <gasps> voices, voices from the past. 
Oh, wow. Are you Kylo Ren? Am I being spoken to through the through the Midichloroverse by none other than he, Kylo Ren? A little spark is all it takes to set the human soul on fire. What has changed behind me? Hmm. Always begins with an act of destruction. That's not true at all. That statement is false. Again, that's not how that works. One life ends. Nice. The right one. Action. What? Fuck that. I can I not fire it into like the middle distance? Action. Oh, I really do have to choose, huh? I have to shoot hers? Right one. Yeah, Satan, you can keep telling me to shoot the right one all you want, but I want to shoot the one in the top hat. You look, but do not see. Nope. Yeah, okay, I can defy Satan. A story as old as time. Who are we to rewrite it? Who are we? Instructions unclear. Dick Haunt and Flintlock pistol. Cool. This is lit gorgeously. Oh, and the loops, brother. The loops. The loops, brother. I want the loops. Yes, brother, the loops, please. We've run out of loops. How can we ever carry on? Wait, we might get more loops. We're in the another loop, brother. This is a black and white loop. Backward we go. Unless. Whew. Oh! Bastard. Will matter at all. I 
feel like that one's about to start hauling ass after me, Jesus. I like how the, um, the autosave icon is a, a film clapper. What are you doing, friend? Jesus Christ. And that is an hour of layers of fear, too. That's pretty good. Now it's time to switch to a new game. It'll be Stygian Reign of the Old Ones coming up next. See you in a moment.